What's going on, y'all? Your boy Drew Cameron. I do the unload sessions on YouTube. I do motivational uh, attack the days or ATD laws. Somebody, one of my clients helped me come up with it years ago. Uh, laws of ATD. So first, let me just give you a backstory. So I'm, a, I'm a father. I'm a husband. Been a father for 16 years, been married for 13 years. And it's not something that I take lightly. You know, both of those jobs, I do my very best at. And those are my main priorities. As a man, it's hard, you know. Four people is what I have to answer to and take care of at all times. Not for the faint at heart, you know. Um, I didn't plan on being a father, you know, but I became one at least starting out, you know, but God had a plan for me and it is what it is. So I've been on this journey for self-improvement, mastering myself my whole life, constantly looking at things, trying to do my best at being the best version of myself. But it's not always easy, you know what I'm saying? Um, I don't have all the answers. I do my best at what I have in front of me, you know, and sometimes my best isn't isn't good, you know, for my wife, for my kids, you know, for the clients that I service. Um, but on this journey, my, my goal and everything I've been doing and building has been to leave something for my kids, man. And, you know, fatherhood, as time goes on, as you master one thing, it's another challenge. And Building a business while being a father, plenty of people have done it. And I'm figuring this out all as I go. I've had a lot of success. I've had a lot of failures. And I never try to make it look better than what it is. I do the best at what I can with the resources I have, you know. And I remember when I got out of the military, right, I got injured. And while... I served, I got early retirement, and it was a blessing and a curse because it gave me opportunities to go after all my passions that I wanted to do and be who I wanted to be. But along that journey, man, I've lost myself plenty of times. I lose myself in this whole process at times, and I try to do my best at getting into a flow. and. It's hard. I mean, I'm not going to make it seem easy. It's hard. Being a father and trying to create and run a business is hard. But I do my best. And like I said, I have a lot of success in that. So I remember when I got out the military, you know, I worked a job for a period of time. I had, I worked at Apple, I worked at Apple for a long time. That was my dream job. But there was no work-life balance, and I hated it, you know. Um, so then I decided to become a barber. And when I did that, it unlocked kind of truly what entrepreneurship was. Now, I had been personal training off and on for years, even before I joined the military. So I was a spirit. But I never really had any systems or a way to do it. And the military helped me to kind of put things in order. So when I decided to finally step out and do something like become a barber, it helped me to kind of get that client base down, helped me to understand people. And, um, you know, I got my real estate license a few years ago, me and my wife. And like I said, managing people and managing your household is hard, man. It's not for the faint at heart. You know, I've had a lot of ups and downs, a lot of um, back and forth with trying to figure it all out. And I, I kind of have a good system now, you know, but it's funny, man, because like I watch like social media, you know, and I've done a lot of work to kind of pull myself off. Like I get on, I post my content, I get the help the heck off because it's an addiction, bro. Like social media is an addiction and we're all hooked, man. You think about dope, you know what I'm saying? Think about the crack wave back in the day. Like this, this stuff is an addiction. 
And so I do my best to stay off of it. I use it to help other fathers, to help other people. Um, but it's hard. It's hard to use it and not abuse it. But I, I think I manage pretty well. You know, I spend about an hour a day on social media tops, you know, and that's a lot of that's promoting, replying back to comments and things like that. But I just had to get on here, man, and just kind of vent, man, because, you know, it's hard. It's hard. It's not for the weak, you know, being a father ain't for the weak. Entrepreneurship is not for the weak. Nothing that I've been doing is for the weak. And I feel like as a man, you are a builder, you are a creator, you know, and you create. And for me, I create systems. I create SOPs, you know. Um, I love building. I love creating, you know. And that's why I love this journey of, you know, being a father and being an entrepreneur. But it's hard. And I tell anybody, you know, make sure you got some money and make sure that you put yourself in a situation where you're prepared to make the sacrifices because it's not all bubble gums and rainbows. It's not what you think, you know, um, but I'm, I'm taking y'all along for the journey, you know, um, doing my best to showcase and be as transparent as possible. That's really it, man. I don't really think I had nothing else to say. Just trying to put it all together, document everything that I'm going through, what I'm dealing with, how I, accomplish these goals. I push out my content. But it's funny because when I watch and I look, I have to laugh at some of the content people put out, including myself and how nobody's being real. Like we're all trying to show one side of the business or one side of how it works. And, you know, at the end of the day, we're solo entrepreneurs. All we did was create a job for ourselves until you got employees until everything is running like a system, you created a job for yourself. And the minute you wake up and realize that, your life would be a whole lot better. But there's nothing wrong with that because you control how you move, how you operate, right? But it's just something that was on my mind. Drew Cameron, this has been an unload session. If you want more structured content, you can, you know, look at the links and look at all the other videos that will probably be attached in here. But that's all I got for today. Sack today.